Hi guys! Welcome back with another video. Oh my god, you wanna... <laughs> Welcome back with another video no, for today since you guys keep on asking me to do another comparison video. So, ayan, your wish is my comment. So, I am for today's video. I'm gonna be sharing with you my honest and also straight to the point review and comparison of this to vitamin C serum. So, ayan, since ang addict talaga ng mga tao ngayon sa mga vitamin C serum, ano? So, if you want to know my thoughts and also my commentary and honest on-point review and also comparison sa mga products na ito, then keep on watching. Some of you guys, like, send me a DM doon sa aking Instagram account. So, kanyang, kung hindi nyo pa na-follow yung Instagram account ko, just check it out. So, ayan, I'm really glad kasi may mga nagtatag na sa akin like, baby please meet me by this sa mga ganun-ganun. So, ayan, you know, you know, it really warms my heart. <laughs> so, ayan, thank you guys for tagging me. So, ayun, medyo naano din ako na flutter on kote. Charing! So, ayan, sa video natin ngayon pala is I'm gonna be viewing both of them. So, parang i-level out natin kung which one really works and which one you should buy. So, in straightforward tayo dito, pasensya na sa mga brand or sa brand, which one brand dito na hindi ko masyado marirecommend. So, ayan, pasensya na kaagad. So, ayan, hee! Before tayo mag-apply ng mga vitamin C serum sa ating face, make sure na nakahilamos na tayo and make sure na nakalagay na tayo ng mga cleanser sa face natin, mga cleansing oil, mga kinamay, mga ganun-ganun. So, ayan, after that is maghilamos ka na ulit kasi nga kapag nag-cleanser ka or naglalagay ka ng mga cleansing oil sa face, eh, syempre, alam nga naman, hindi mo siya i-wash out ulit. So, you need to wash it off again. So, after that, is maglalagay ka na nung pinatawag nilang toner. So, yung mga toner naman na mas suggest ko sa inyo, guys, is yung mga like, tayers. Yung toner na ginagamit ko currently naman is yung sa Rix. So, yun, kung hindi na pa nakita yung video about sa Rix, please check. Check. <laughs> please check this video. So, ayan, right now is after ng toner, is gagamit ka na ng vitamin C serum. Yung always naman inaasa akin, yung when nga ba ginagamit yung vitamin C serum, you can use it twice a day, three times a week. So, ayan, ganun lang po. So, ayan, huwag nyong araw-arawin. Today's comparison video is, ito yung paglalabanin natin. Bate lang sa So, ayan, this is your Lyco na vitamin C serum. So, yung nakalagay dito, ha, is Lyco California vitamin C serum. Ayan, pasosyal to. And this is your daily vitamin C serum. Ayan, this one is glass po yung ano niya, ha? Always remember, this one is glass and this one is plastic. Alright, so, pag-usapan natin dito yung packaging niya. So, yung packaging po ng Lyco is plastic nga. So, yung sa Braille is, ano na siya, glass. It's very luxurious kapag titignan mo siya. Ayan, pwede siya pang display actually. And ito na, pwede mo siya pang display. Pero yung kagandahan din nito is kapag may mga baby kayo sa bahay ninyo or mga bata, like, they can throw it without worrying na mababasa to. Kasi ito glass, ito plastic. So, yung next naman is, like, labeling dito. Yung label nito is a little bit hindi mo siya dumakita. Um, for example, like, malabo yung mata mo, just like me. You really need to have, like, eyeglasses siguro. Or kapag mababa na yung brain mo, it's fine. Pero for me naman, this one is very, very pasosyal lang siya ng koonte, which is nice. And this one naman is talagang binigyan talaga niya priority yung kanyang labeling. Yung next naman natin titignan nito is yung ingredients niya. This one is meron siyang vitamin C and meron siyang hyaluronic acid. And this one is meron siyang vitamin C because vitamin C nga. So, this one is meron siyang vitamin C and wala siyang hyaluronic acid but meron siyang glycerin. Now, pag-usapan natin yung glycerin and hyaluronic acid. Now, hyaluronic acid is a natural form of chemical na makikita sa ating katawan. It traps yung skin or yung moist sa ating skin para magiging um, plump siya and also healthy and also batang tignan. Pag-usapan naman natin yung glycerin. So, yung glycerin is a type of ingredient na may ginagamit sa mga pagkain o also sa mga skincare ngayon to preserve the moist din. So, ayan. Pwede siyang gamitin ngayon sa face. Ako dito, guys, kasi nga, diba, na, sabi ko kanina, na dalawang to is made in China. So, ayan, nagulat ako kasi pag tinignan ko yung ano nila, yung packaging nila dito, nakalagay dito is not tested sa animals, which is I'm, I'm amazed. Ayan, by the way, just wanna quick disclaimer lang, hindi po ako expert or hindi po ako doctor na you know, <laughs> marami kasi nagko-comment sa mga videos ko about it. Both of them is cruelty-free. So, ayan, amazing. So, but meron lang pala kung ano, yung ibang product nila is meron mga parabin, which is 
Anyways, yung parabin naman ang ginagamit nila dito is yung pinaka ano talaga, yung pinaka mahina when it comes to parabin. So, ayan. Just wanna put it out there. Once again, guys, dito ko ilalagay yung braille, ha? Paalala lang po kapag gagamit po ng mga ganito. Alright, so since nalagay ko na yung Braille, pag-uusapan naman natin doon yung claims dito sa Braille. So yung nakalagay dito sa Braille, this one is for skin brightening or whitening talaga siya. So aside from that, wala na siya nakalagay dito yung ibang claims. So usually talaga yung mga function ng mga vitamin C serum is nakakalighten sila sa mga, sa mga dark spot natin dito sa face. And also kapag may mga pimples naman kayo, it really helps doon sa pimples na mag-shrink ka agad siya at hindi na talaga siya mag alam mo yung mag-revent talaga siya hindi, parang ginagawa siyang hinog ka agad pagkatapos pahiling agad siya, ayun parang ano yung parang high pimples bite uh, so ayan so ayan, nililinsang ko lang yung aking kamay and we're gonna be using the Lyco for the Lyco naman, once again, this is how it looks like, so one so that's two, three, four and five Yung sa Lyco is medyo same lang din naman siya sa Brilli para yung consens consensus <laughs> consistency niya. So, ayan. Alright, so, ayan. Okay, so titignan naman natin yung claims dito naman sa Lyco. So yung Lyco na kalagay dito is whitening, antioxidant, and remove spots. Usually, that is the general function talaga ng vitamin C is to remove spots. Ayan, it helps to shrink your blemishes or your pores there. That is your Brady and also your Lyco. Ayan, i-dry ko lang siya and I will see you in a bit. So, and after how many minutes or like 20 minutes, then this is how it looks like. So, once again guys, yung itsura neto is really depends kung gaano ka thick yung formula or gaano ka dami yung mga preservatives niya or yung mga oils niya nandito. So, ayan, eto naman kapag titignan ko dito, yes, medyo obvious talaga na yung reflect talaga ng ilaw is makikita mo siya and dito naman is parang walang reflect ng ilaw which this one makes it a little bit blurred and this one naman is a little bit like gloss which is I'm living for it kasi kapag dito parang ang healthy ng mukha ko and dito naman okay na din naman siya actually so ayan this one is your Lyco and this one is your Braille so we're gonna be talking about more sa Lyco and Braille so let's start doon sa price niya muna so, so yung price nito is this one and yung price ng Braille is this one so ayan mag-iiba-iba yung mga prices nito depende kapag meron kang voucher, meron kang mga coupons, coupons and also kapag merong mga promo yung Lazada and also yung Shopee. So, ayan. So, na quick reminder kapag gumagamit kayo nito and meron kayo napansin na parang kakaiba sa face ninyo like parang, you know, tinutusok-tusok yung face ninyo, um, let it be kasi ganyan talaga kapag gumagamit kayo ng mga serums or yung mga vitamin C. So, ayan yung ibang mga vitamin C is yung iba nga is mainit sa mukha but this one is hindi. Wala silang mainit na sensation sa face which is I'm living for. So, hindi talaga akong mahilig sa mga skincare na merong mga mainit sa face na formula. So, ayan. Just wanna put it up there. So, ayan. Let's talk about doon sa kanila mga finishes. Ano ha? Just wanna do like a very honest review to you guys. Ayan. Yung Brilli is medyo matagal siya mag-dry which is I'm fine or I'm okay with it kapag gamitin ko siya pag morning. Pag morning naman is it really needs time to like to dry out. So, ayan. Yung kabila naman, this one is your like one. So, ayan. Maybe most of you guys will gonna like the like one kasi nga ang bilis siya mag-dry which is pwede siya kapag on the go ka talaga always and kapag nagmamadil ka. Kapag dito naman sa belly is more likely pang gabi talaga to kasi nga ang tagal niya mag -dry. Ako naman gumagamit ang mga vitamin C kapag gabi. Hindi ako gumagamit sa morning kasi nga nag-oxidize siya and gives you like impression na kapag gamit yung vitamin C sa morning or like kapag gamit yung vitamin C sa morning is magkaroon siya ng parang nakaroon siya ng reaction doon sa sun so ayan, yan lang talaga yung pinaka problem ka when it comes to vitamin C kasi nga parang nagiging useless siya I don't know ha, hindi naman ako doctor so ayun guys, more likely naman I don't really have like bad comments about both of them Pero, kapag gusto nyo talaga ng talagang, talagang, talagang nakakatanggal talaga ng dark spots or talagang nakaka-help na ma-ease uh, out yung dark spots, dark spots, dark spots ninyo, uh, very short period of time, is I can really recommend the really one kasi nga, medyo strong yung formulation niya. Kapag gusto nyo naman na medyo mas mura and also nakaka-help din naman siya kahit na mura siya, you can go with the Lyco product. But, kung katulad nyo ko na medyo mainitin, 
I can really recommend like both of them use like in the morning kasi nga mabilis siyang mag-dry and use really sa evening kasi medyo siya matagal mag-dry. Ayan, since wala naman akong mga allergic reaction both of them, I can really use them both. So, ayan, I don't know about you guys. So, let me know in the comments down below if na-try nyo na yung both products na ito or hindi pa. So, ayan, I can't really give you like very bad or very, you know, intrusive or hateful comment about like these products. Gamura siya and also very ambut kaya talaga when it comes to mga budgetarian moms and also titas and also mga ates natin and also mga kuyas na medyo yung nagtitipid talaga pero gustong magkaro ng mga skincare products. Let me know in the comments down below kung ano mga products na gusto nyo ipatry sa akin next time. Before pala I forgot is yes, kapag gusto nyo pala mga vitamins na medyo mamahalid just go with the other products kung ayun, gusto nyo mga FDA approved and all of that. So ayan, you can buy the other brands pero kung gusto nyo na naman medyo mura talaga you can go with this one. So, ayun. Just a quick reminder guys kasi meron pa mga nababasa mga comments about it. So, ayan. Just wanna put it up there. So, ayan guys. Hindi ito pwede maging alternative for glutathione pala. Just wanna put it up there kasi iba naman kasi yung nagtatanong sa'yo like Chris, pwede ba itong papaputi? You can use it na pantalot doon sa papaputi ninyo na regime. Pero hindi talaga siya yung parang, okay, ito na lang tayo gagamit para pumuti. Which is very wrong kasi this one gives you like glowy skin, not white complexion. Yan lang yung talagang sasabi ko. Pero this one gives you like impression na parang maputi ka this day, parang ganun. So ayan, kapag titignan mo naman yung face ko, ayan, medyo okay naman siya sa face. It's brightening, especially dito na part. And dito naman is parang, ang puti niya tignan because nga nagmata. Nagmat ka agad siya. So, ayun guys, um, ayun, uh, by the way guys, before I forget, I encourage you guys to like this video kapag nagustuhan ninyo and also subscribe to, uh, subscribe to my channel kapag nag subscribe to my channel if gusto nyo mag mga 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 and also subscribe to my YouTube channel kung gusto nyo yung masali doon sa ating family. So, ayun na, I love you guys and I'll see you next time.